In this video, I'm going to show you how to save a file, email a file, and write a file using your Lynx Access tool for iOS. So we always recommend, before you make any parameter changes to the chair, that you always save a copy of the file in case you need it at a later time. Now how you would do that is you would go to the upper right-hand corner of the screen to the Menu Application tab, tap on that, and then hit Save As. Now it will come up with the file name the way it came from the factory, which you can use, or you can delete that and name the file whatever you wish to name it. I'm going to use the factory name and I'm going to hit save. Now I've successfully saved it and I'm going to hit continue. Now when you save a file, it lives on the device you saved it to. So if you're using your iPad, the file will be on your iPad. If you use your iPhone, it will be on your iPhone. Um, it is not in a cloud, it's actually saved on that device. Now how I access those files is I'm going to go to the very top of my screen and in the center there is a little file tab next to the blue wheelchair and I'm going to tap on that. And now I can see all the files I have saved to my device. So if I want to email the file that I just saved, which is the fourth file down, I am going to go up to the edit button in the top right hand corner of the screen and then bubbles will appear on the left hand side of the files. I'm going to tap on the copy of the Aviva file that I just saved and now I'm going to go down to the bottom right hand corner to the little forwarding tab and tap on that and it comes up giving me the option to be able to click on my mail which I will do and now I have the file in a new message and I can tap in the email address and email the file. So now I'm going to just cancel that out. And let's say I wanted to now write that file back to the chair. So for example, I just made a bunch of programming changes. The person doesn't really like them. They just want it to be set back to the way they had the chair before. That's easy. All now I have to do is open that file, the copy of Aviva file, by tapping on it. It's going to open the file. And if I go to the upper right hand corner to the menu application tab again, I can then tap right to chair. And it will reload that chair back into it with the settings it had when I first started. 